Tuesday evening and as always um, it's the best time for me to record my day where I'm sharing with everyone one thing that I achieved, one thing that I learned and one thing that I find out that I need to fix. Doing it every day, um, it takes some time to go through your day and to think about those three elements or things, whatever you want to call it, uh, but it's definitely helpful encourage you to do the same. That's the classical um, opening that I'm doing each and every day, just to encourage other people to do what I'm doing as well. And it's time to um, to share today. So uh, going to be, I think, a little bit uh, longer since um, uh, one of the topic is really um, deep to my heart. So I'll start with that, that's the achievement for today, which is a little bit of achievement and a little bit of disappointment, everything uh, go uh, together. So the achievement is that uh, it took um, around almost uh, three months of work with a um, lawyer to try to come with an agreement that, um, like a formal agreement that um, People that are going to join Galaxy uh, are going to sign. Um, it's so complex because the current law system that we have and the current um, structure of companies is so targeted into one way of working and it's so unopened to others. So um, it's hard. <laughs> and um, the, the, the are I think two main difficulties. One is if you want to create a structure when you share with people the revenue or the profit of the company based on what people are contributing to the company, that's not an issue. But if you also want to provide people benefit and you just started the company and um, um, it's actually even a kind of a non-profit company and money is not flowing yet to the system. If you commit to people that you're going to do it, you commit to it. <laughs> and if someone in some point of time say, okay, I'm working for the company, but uh, there are no revenue because no, uh, nothing came from, from, from all the projects that you're doing or all the um, avenue that you put in place in order to get more revenue into the company, uh, or even if someone says, okay, I just want my benefit um, and the company doesn't have income yet or enough income, uh, then you uh, as the right now sole owner uh, is, is liable for that. Um, and that's a problem. Uh, or that's a risk that you need to take. So uh, probably um, there's no chance but taking this risk uh, if you want to really move a company forward um, that based on what you really believe and I truly believe that um, you should share like a company is a group of people that are working for the same purpose um, not everyone should uh, earn the same it's not that case but definitely everyone needs to earn percentage of what the company earned based on the contribution that they have to the company this is like a huge incentive for people to be part of the company just incentive for people to do a lot of work in order to to get something out of it and it's extremely fair because if the company makes more and more money people are getting more and more money there's no cap uh, to the um, to, 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 your, to your compensation on the flip side if the market goes down there's no cap uh, how much the, um, your compensation goes down but I think it's much more fair to impact everyone compensation for the good and for the bad based on what the company earned but based on the performance of the company rather than uh, let people go when uh, the market goes down and um, cap their earning when the, everything is, is, is glory so uh, even the term agent that uh, we are using because we are based on complex adaptive system which agent is a basic element there apparently is, is, is something wrong in the legal world. So it's so frustrating that uh, you want to do something 
and, and there's no support um, legally wise or you're taking huge risk personally if you want to do it but you know life is all about risk and if you believe in something you need to do it so apparently um, I have to do it if I want to move forward with that so that's the achievement and that's the um, that's the um, other it's, not an, it's an achievement for sure it took a lot of time to work on that but it's not necessarily exactly what I want and that's that's kind of a frustration. So um, that's that's for the achievement for today. Uh, learning, uh, I learned today that the 70 to 80 percentage of change management are actually, guess, successing or failing, right, failing. Um, and the main reason is that people okay with changes People are not happy with changes that someone shove down the throat. And most of the time where you communicate a change with people, you already make the decision. And people are smart enough to understand that you already make the decision and you are just trying to convince them to do it. And then whoop, the frustration level goes up and uh, the pushback goes up and it's too late. So that's what I learned today. 70 to 80 percentage of change management are failing. Uh, last but not least, one thing that I find out that I need to fix. So today I was totally engaged in a discussion with uh, someone trying to, by the way, help someone else. And I simply didn't pay attention that I um, simply lost the meeting. And I really hate when it's happening. Well, it's, it's, it's the first time that it happened since I'm I'm sharing with you this video and I don't remember where it happened last time, but it happened. Uh, so there's definitely something that I want to fix. Uh, shouldn't, um, shouldn't, people shouldn't wait for me to a meeting. I'm not showing up. This is really, really, really bad on my side. I really feel horrible about it. So uh, that's all. Uh, one thing that I finally need to fix the hard way today. Uh, an achievement that comes with a disappointment and what I learned and that's all for today tomorrow uh, it's in another day I hope it will be a better day um, and if everything will go by the plan <coughs> I'm going to share with you tomorrow my day as well and up until then as always 